I'm so sleepy. I should go to sleep now. So our first video for the three scary games we're gonna play is Go to Bed. So I found this game in Itayo. It was one of the popular games. All right, situation one. Go to bed. So to be honest, I did record once this game until the end, and then the like recording broke. So I'm recording this the second time. So I might know what to do. A little at least. Let me just turn down the media source for a little. I mean, did you lock the door? Oh yeah. <laughs> I did that on purpose because I know that you guys might like, you know. So whatever it is, like I said, it was a robber. So what I was expecting is a robber. Situation fell, someone got in. So maybe it was a robber. Like a robot might go in and then take your like stuff and then kill you, I think. So go to bed as usual. Um so the painting we cannot do anything. I thought the flashlight we can open. Hey no no, the light. We thought I thought we can open the light, but instead it was the door. Alright, so what else can I do? Close window. Okay, that's important because that might play a crucial role to like for protective our protecting our home because imagine if a robot came in and then like snuck whatever clap your cheeks maybe and then said damn boy your cheeks so good i want to clap it every day all right so this is important the security is important so i don't know okay is that a picture of me or, or my husband maybe maybe we're a girl maybe we're a lady we cannot expect our gender though. Oh, hide knives. Yeah. We need to hide this. We need to hide those knives because what if what if the robot takes the knives and then break it and take the knives? It will kill us before he go to the jail. Alright, so the cupboard, we can we cannot do anything. Um what else? What else? Okay, so the door. We need to lock the door. This is the most important part of the security. Remember, remember to do this, kids. Even if your parents do it for you, you need to do it also, just in case. If you might forget, you might forget. They might forget. So you need to do it also, like extra check. You do it also. You check the doors. Is it locked or no? Because what if a robot comes in and then alive everyone? That might be so dangerous. So you guys need to do your jobs also. Okay, so there's nothing else I can do, right? Yeah. So I think I think we can go to bed now. All right. So we're sleeping. Did you lock the front door? Let me guess. Did I did I lock? I mean, the hugest lock ever. Yeah, you can go in. You just want to clap those cheeks, you ain't getting any. Did you close the window? I mean, I closed the damn out of the window, though. I want to be, I want to be so safe that the robber cannot even clap those cheeks. Did you arm the home security system? Yes. Yes, I did. And they broke in. That's why I said we need to hide those knives. Did you hide the knives? I mean, yeah, yeah, I did. Because I know um they will come in if anyways. That's how dangerous the game is, right? So the police there. There's no knife. There's no nothing. What else can you do? I'm guessing they cut the robot. Well done. No one, no one will get in. Will. I mean, yes, of course, we'll get in, but like, usually doing this gives you like, do you know, like those feelings where like you lock the door and then halfway that you think, did I lock the door? 
So you double check and then make sure, yes, you did lock the door. It happens to me a lot. So like, just in case if you guys want to like do it, you guys need to remember you lock the door. And I just pressed bed. I forgot to lock those doors. Is the house secure? No. <laughs> All right, situation two. Let's see what what we what we do. What did we miss? Go to bed. Whatever. By the way, what, as I was saying on our first video, like whoever lives here, like put treasures on the bed, put boxes. I think whoever this is is a dangerous person. Like, okay, so we, we we're gonna hide the knives. Okay, there's nothing else we can interact. Not the refrigerator. Um. Okay, we gotta do anything with the cupboard. But home security system is important, and then we need to lock the door, and then lastly we need to like close the window. But before that, let's let's yeah, let's do it. I was gonna say about um the basement, yeah. Like I said, I think the guy, whoever this is, I think it's a serial killer or at least a P word for the YouTubers, famous YouTubers, if you guys. Well, I'm not discriminating, but like, I don't know why they do it. But like, imagine putting people in their basement. Like, what's, why would they do that? What's, what's the problem? I mean... Is the house secure? Yes, it is. It's so secure. It's secure than anyone else. Are you sure? Damn, I'm sure. Are you gonna ask? Knives? Good. Bro, you didn't have nice knives, door, or anything. Situation 3. Like I was saying, I mean, maybe, maybe the place... Oh. Huh? Where am I? How did I get here? I mean, maybe, maybe this is the basement. Maybe, maybe someone took you. No. I need to just get out of here. Yeah, I cannot sleep. But it looks like we've been here for a while for some reason because it really looks like it's we've been here a while. Maybe maybe we we gave a ride to a guy and then the guy like bonk our head and put our put us in the basement. I need to leave now. Yeah. If I were you, I would leave it immediately like imagine there's a bunch of cow and then the basement is not even cold it's just dusty is that a bone like what's even the point putting putting like cows i thought it was a face like they they really do it to resemble the face right so like in purposely why do you even put cow meat on the basement if it's not cold it's not like is that a body Bro, it's it's a whole ass body. So like, what's the point putting like a whole ass um cow meat, and then it went quiet immediately uh, as long as I took the key. I know there's gonna be a jump scare time soon, but like, I just need to get ready. There's no point in putting like cow milk, cow meat in the basement. If it's not cold, it's just gonna rot anyways. Alright. I mean, it's really dark. What, what you guys see, even I, that's all I see. So we can climb up. So we're in the in the basement, right? The basement where, like, the, I said, whoever that guy was, crazy. He would do that, like, he doesn't mind anyway. It's shut. I should check for an alarm before before breaking it. Yeah. You should and then check the home it's arm maybe i can get the wire with something yeah the knives it's locked and need a code but that's a door the knife should be behind here right yeah do you put anything useful i mean i don't even turn this down Okay, so like maybe we should like do something to prepare. Like, what if we didn't do everything, and then suddenly we're this guy? Why? Hey, aren't you in bed? 
So mm -hmm. go to bed. A short mm -hmm. horror game by Joseph Mullars. Sorry for watching. Thank you for playing. So this is go to bed. So it's such a nice game. I read it like um eight out of ten. Very scary. Very good. Hmm. I just wanna live someone. What should I do? Where should I? What should I do? Maybe I should find a perfect spot to put the body in. Yeah, that might be a good idea. Hello everyone. So our next game on our three horror game is Perfect Spot. It's one of the highest like number three in HIO. So I thought maybe I should play this game. Maybe it's good. Maybe. What is a perfect spot? It is a place where you make the best memories while the rest are silent. So what I'm what I'm guessing is whatever perfect spot is it's not here what do you mean what do you mean it looks it is a cemetery right imagine imagine you having a perfect spot in a cemetery like what's even the point bro i was expecting perfect spot is like around like you know somewhere somewhere like up a hill tree maybe maybe your old house instead you do it in a cemetery. What's this? Missing person. Okay, two of them are kids, but one looks like a ground person. So I'm more concerned about the kids and the ground person. Okay, so there's a broom. I'm guessing someone who works here goes here like every day. So let's find our like quote unquote perfect spot. <laughs> okay so there's just a repeating like repeating kid what's that just a rock all right so this is not our perfect spot at least yet okay so leaves more graves i mean just in case though just in case we need to be safe because this thing ain't a perfect spot if you ask me the chances are this is a perfect spot is this ain't a perfect spot all right so hmm i still don't think uh, we can find a perfect spot because the graves are like damn so hard a bunch of missing people i mean Firstly, they said that okay, what is it? Is that a leaf? Perfect spot is somewhere is this is this a perfect spot? Nope. I already thought it was a perfect spot because it looks so nice. Maybe here. Maybe maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Hello there. What's this? A statue of So there's horns and wing, I'm guessing neutral between an angel and a devil right so weird why do i why do they have that in the cemetery i think i don't even know they they have a church but like a devil and angel oh is that does that mean it's a perfect spot get a shovel from the car at least we found our perfect spot here we go anywhere back is there any way we can go no yep there's no way. Mm, just in case. Maybe there's gonna be like a hiding. I thought there was gonna like be like a key or a person at least behind one of those graves. Because like you can't expect anything here. Okay, so there's a church. I'm still curious about, about the church and the statue. Such a weird thing to have a statue of a devil and then church nearby and then a bunch of graves with But oh, that's a lock. I thought I thought it was something like going on to me. Okay, so dig up the spot. Alright, so the spot was the furthest like damn bro. Aren't you gonna like dig up a corpse or something? Like maybe corpse husband. <laughs> I don't know what what's what happened to him. It's been a while. I haven't seen him like post stuff. 
if you guys know what happened to corpse husband comment down below it might be good maybe i can understand what happened to him oh why 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 are we looking at the statue get the body from the car either i did the guy don't want like put the animation of us digging or the statue actually plays a crucial role in this okay so it's still there it's still it's still in the same spot All right yeah i'm just gonna look maybe it's like a fallen angel thing where if you don't look it's gonna chase you like make make sense right fallen angel because it's a statue also plus it's an angel and a devil so my a fallen angel is like similar get the body from the car i just realized i just realized the task get the body from the car i was too focused on the statue i didn't realize our task is get the body did the statue did the statue change places it did it did change hey yo bro this might be dangerous but i ain't gonna look back because i know repent your sins in the church at least dug the body can you dock the body no bro if you put the body like that and then repent your sins it ain't gonna work trust me i know like at least hide the body what if someone like i'm still i'm still curious about this one what are you doing what are you doing why you look so mysterious looks like it's like on top of a body let me double check the body maybe maybe the spot well there's a shadow of the the shadow of the statue is supposed to go but the statue like went to other place and then it, it doesn't have a shadow anymore <laughs> oh my fucking god i'm guessing those are three kids that we killed maybe 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 yeah maybe maybe the three kids we killed because like because we're a crazy person repent okay, how do i repent what is this a never-ending hallways i'm guessing the reason it says repent the way actually the church wasn't that this long is that a lock bang on it i will crack i will i will pull the like put towel on it and pull it it will work hello there what's your name <laughs> such a good wave okay so the key repent i'm guessing the kid says hi because like you see what you did hello there oh <laughs> Okay, so let's use the key on the lock. Where is this? Are those hats? Can I go back? Bro. Okay, they look different. I thought they were like repeating. But some of the face look similar. Simi similar. Like... I used to watch YouTubers play game, right? The faces look. Did I did I go for sound? No, it wasn't me. Okay, this one's black. Oh, maybe it's burned. Can I open this? Yes. All right. So there's body bags and bunch of whispers. Hello. Hmm. The shadow is very pixelated. I think I think they didn't have time to do it. Stab. How do I stab if I don't have a knife? I can't go. I can't go. Wait, can I? No, I cannot go out. I don't even have a knife. How do I even stab? I like how to create a meat like super creepy. But like the floor is like just repeating blood it's so nice All right okay so there's a bunch of missing this person i don't understand what am i supposed to do is there 
I'm guessing there's supposed to be a knife somewhere. It's telling us to step, but like, oh yeah, I already said there's gonna be a knife. Our um one dollar knife. Step, 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 step. How do you step? I don't know. How do you step in this? Wait, are we stepping? There is blood on the knife, but I don't know if we are stabbing. Oh. Okay. That took the whole knife away. <laughs> wake up. I am wake up. So what's this? Another endless hallway of nothing. It's just wanted posters of the kids that this guy might have might have unalived them. Makes sense. Guess make it make sense though. Oh my god, it's a blood. Repent or go back. I will make it two versions of this, so all endings because just in case. Oh my god, what is that? Oh, it's the thing. Um. Oh, I didn't do anything, officers. I didn't do anything. We will, we will, we will, we will. <laughs> I'm guessing we repent. Okay. So let me repeat that and try another ending. Okay. So we're back. Okay, so repent or go back. What happens if we go back? Alright, that's good. And then we can go like nothing ever happened. Okay, that's good to know. That's good to know. Because we ain't a B. Okay, so thank you guys for watching. Let's go to the next video. Alright, let's go to the left. Go to the right. Go to the left again. Oh wait. Who's calling me right now? Hello everyone! The, the third video, last video is Uno Lingo. Hi, it's Uno. Looks like you missed your Spanish lesson again. Hey there, you have missed your lesson yet again. Yeah, because I was busy, I have a life. Can you leave me alone? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry I'm bothering you. It's your learning goals. Well, you are, obviously. Okay, I'm tired of this. See you soon. What? What does that even mean? Oh. Oh, no shot. Uno says, I ain't want all of that. I want, I want you. Come here, bro. Get in my belly. <laughs> so? I don't know. I don't know what am I supposed to do. I can't see anything. Oh, it was loading, bro. It was loading. I thought, why was it dark for a minute? Hello. Oh, no. So all we need to do is promise. Promise Uno we're going to learn Duolingo. We're going to learn some Spanish. Spanish lessons. My head. How did I get Ooh. here? Bro, it's a kid. Of course, they have a light. They have school and all. So, can I rotate this? Fine. What is that? I don't know what to do first. Okay, let's hide here. Missing items. I'm guessing we need to find one, right? So, I'm guessing... From what I understand, what is that? Promo to M. Damn, I don't know Spanish at all. Guessing Uno said it took us here to learn. I mean, it is good, but considering this guy, this the the person we're playing is a kid. Imagine what. 
What? Dwarling could even lock the door. Turn you into an anti. Oh jeez. Wasn't expecting that. Miss your streak, turn you into an anti. Spanish or vanish. Chinese or no knees. Japanese or I snap your knees. I Damn. thought I made it easy to understand. Damn. Two days remaining. I'm guessing it's like grannies. But like. I like the concept. I like the concept. Like, Uno is Uno is cool. I mean, Duolingo is actually starting to get cool. Your family but like, as much pop, pop. As you missed my streaks. But why? Why does Uno sounds like a girl? Like, a very hot girl. All right. So what's this? Another puzzle. Correct sentence required. What's that? What is what is that white thing? There's a lot of it in the ground. Hmm. Okay. So what 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 is that? Whoever finds this, you have not much time. The longer bird has captured me. I may never escape these clutches. Been since I was taken, and I've been trying to outsmart the relentless bird at every turn. At first, I thought it was just trying to teach me a new language but now i'm not sure there's something more sinister at play here i can feel it in my bones the bird's lesson have become increasingly difficult almost as if it's preparing me for something but for what i don't know but i refuse and give up hope i've managed to find a key card to the exit i hidden it in my cell where that pesky bird won't find it i just need to buy time find it i just need to what is that by time wait for the right moment to make my escape if you're reading this no i haven't given up i will find a way out of here no matter what it takes jenny hey yo jenny jenny i'm guessing i'm guessing the person we played is a girl or a guy but boy i don't know but jenny so all we need to do is find the key right key the key to success the key to the exit from uno lingo from uno but like i don't know can i open this i can just don't get just don't get caught like oh what is that okay i see i see uno okay, let's go over here open this close just in case I don't know if you can hear like me closing the door, but I can crouch, it's good. What is this? Find your lesson in the beast. Equantera to an L. I understand, I understand. Whatever Equantera no L mean. I know L is the. Why is the monkey shaking? Okay, those two ain't shaking. Are you guys. I don't think so. So let me just. Oh my fucking god! Oh my effing god, bro! Oh! Just don't step on the like dolls, right? If I step, there's gonna do a squeaky sound. Can I open this? Can I close it? Right. Can it find me? No. Agarada por la gazanas de la oponium. Sorry if I butcher my Spanish. I don't know Spanish. I can speak Bahasa if you guys want, but Spanish ain't my in my in my language. Bro, they have a whole CCTV, but like, doesn't it make sense if Duolingo is Uno? At least it's at the CCTV instead of walking around. Yes, walking around is good because you may have better chance on getting it. But like, what's even the point? All right, so don't step on this. Okay, so that's the exit. Okay, so this is back, back to where we are, where we were. Good to know, good to know. All right, so we need to do the puzzle. This one first. Find your lesson in the beast. Equantera to something, something, and L. All right, so what was it? Agarada 
for for what for for uh is it de la IR for de la no oh shit is she coming she broke their streaks so I broke their legs oh shit I get a move bro so unfair they didn't even let me move you Yeah, I know. I have last day, last day. We're gonna do it last day. Last day, we're gonna do it. Trust me. Last day. Okay, yeah, everything looks the same at least. They do Your family seems nice. It would be a shame if they started missing their lessons too. Yeah, why not they get get them also and then make a whole ass family here what do they what do we eat anyway here i mean if if duolinga gives us a bad and good food i mean i will stay here i don't mean i don't mind if learning um, spanish every day rather than going to school the school is like more than just one spanish thing let me just remember n right I think I think it's big is based on um RNG. I need to check. Let's go out. Okay, so this thing. I'm gonna try um Agarada for last Garas. Can I? No. Wait, can I? I think I need to like remove everything, but like. I cannot hide here, right? I don't know. I'm scared that dwelling Miss, Miss Uno might, might as well like come into like the door out of nowhere. Like, we don't know. We don't know the chances are. Oh, so. Okay, so it does remove. So Agarada for Las Garas de la what uh, obsession? Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. It works. It works. A dialer. All right. So we can use this on the like our cell. At least Duolingo is supposed to put it on our cell because like what's the reason like putting it on our cell like, if we don't have like this thing. So we close this just in case, just in case, just in case if you could get get in, it would be dangerous. All right, so I I hardly remember this one. Abe, abe, abemo. Abe small or two n. Let us hide. Okay, so that's our being bucket. I'm so surprised. The link at least ready as our like our ping bucket and then bed. Okay, let me just. Close my eyes because it's so it's so so small. It, or, or my screen is too big. To ab ab more. All right. So I'm guessing this is the card, right? Key card to go out. Okay, so let's open this. Before that, we have to make sure Uno is far away before we proceed. Oh yeah, by the way, it's not based on RNG, I think. So, if the first day, if you already know all the answers, you can go out already. But this game is not based on RNG like Granny at least. 
because I'm guessing it was made in a gem maybe like a gem used to give you like one week to do the game oh sheesh what are you going here now so the exit is over there remember Spanish or Finnish and then giga chat duolingo go by like huh you wanna you wanna you wanna vanish all right so we need to go over there so we can go to the exit right just get ready this ready okay so mistakes are the gateway to our realm <laughs> yeah i know i know duolingo i know okay so we need to open this. Why can I? Why can we open the door without the key card? New lessons await. Oh no, bro! So I think that's all. Thank you guys for watching our three scary games. I hope you guys liked all our my three scary games. And I hope I do some kids also, because why not? Kids looks up, makes the video more fun. So thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time. Bye bye.